We're back, fellow knife enthusiast. That's right, another knife brand spotlight coming your way. And this time it's trained on steel wheel. Um, SMG Inc., a uh, Sportman U Factor Inc. group, is an American company established in 2008. They own both Gletcher, a brand that produces air guns, and Steel Wheel, a brand that produces tactical and outdoor knives. Nope, there's your background on that. They use a variety of the best time-tested steel from the United States, Austria, Japan, and other countries to ensure each knife lives up to its designated purpose. Uh, their choice of material for handles is influenced by practicality, safety, and reliability. reliability. It's a tough word to say for her. It is. It's very difficult. Which is why they prefer to use materials like G10, Micarta, um, I think they have a few FRN ones, and some other high-strength rubberized composite materials. So. Sounds good to me. Yeah. This can be seen in all the knives, even in the new knives, like the Screamer. <coughs> can we just have a scream take place in the background? Like an eagle? Eagle is probably a real scream. Okay, real, real scream, scream would be is. cooler. So um, is your Screamer. Three different versions of this knife. It's something very steel wheel. A majority of their knives come in various forms. I mean, deferring in handle color, blade finish, and backspacer color. So first has, let me make sure it's right. Okay, go ahead. Ready? Yep. The first has a black G10 handle with a black wash blade and a red aluminum spacer. What? Okay. The second, no, no, no. I thought it was blue. Nope. My second fault. is the same handle but a satin finish and a blue aluminum backspacer. And since this satin finish is on the uh, blade, it's also on the pocket. Clip. That's where I got the blue from, sorry. Yeah. And the last has a blue G10 handle, a satin finish, and a red yes. aluminum backspacer. That's kind of just Steel Wheels thing is yep. doing that. Yep, the making of one knife into a few different styles. And there's always like two versions of the knife in like a neutral color, like black, and then the one shocking version. Like the blue one here? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And like the Steel Wheel Modus in the teal version, mm -hmm. which we have. Great, because I love the color of this knife. It's the FRN handle one. It has a black backspacer. However, um, Steel Wheel doesn't do just folding knives. Nope, they have a wide range of fixed blades, as well as the Romer. Hold on, you gotta... Which I... We have a lot I think we of steel gave wheels. away... We had... We got another a one. A few AK Blade episodes. Oh, yeah, yeah, we did. Back. <clears throat> so here's the Romer. Just yep. so you guys can see. Um, I remember they also have the Sentence, the Dark Angel, and the Fervor, which are my favorite steel wheel fixed blades. Mm. And, of course, the more popular Druid. <gasps> wow. That, that big which, mamma Which jamma. one is this one? I think it's That's the... That's the Druid, 230. 230. Yeah, it's just the Argo knot, person. which we don't have we don't or have sell any longer, do we? I don't think, I don't think so. so. And the Courage, which I also don't think. No, that one I think was discontinued. One of them is discontinued. The Argo knot. Yeah, so. Because we had one to give away last year that we didn't have no more of it. Disappointing. Yep. The Courage actually features uh, hidden pins, I think, so you don't see any screws or holes on mm -hmm. the handle. Just one of Steel Wheel's, you know, unique features. Uh, what do you think is their most popular folding knife? I mean, if you had to like narrow it down. Well, because they got they have a lot. They have Entry, the Cut Jack, the Plague Doctor, the uh, Tenant, the Jenna that we gave away, and then the I'm gonna Modus. let you keep going. I don't think I can keep going. There's it's either the Modus or mm -hmm. the Intrigue, or it could be Cut Jack. I don't know. I mean, the Plague Doctor sold pretty well when it first came out. The Cut Jack, yeah, but. I guess if I had to choose like super most popular, maybe most sold, I would have, probably have to say the Modus. Yeah, probably. Could be Cut Jack because of the price. I can't remember how low. It was cut pretty Jack low. Is. I think it was. I don't want to say and be wrong. So. Yeah. Heaven forbid. We think their least favorite this would be the Chatbot or the Shabo, as I got Joel to say once. <sighs> okay, that was one time, and it was for joke. Yeah, so. For me, it was. You didn't know till later. Uh, okay, okay. But All let's right, just go on. Guys, let us know what your favorite or least favorite is by Steel leaving wheel? a comment below. Also, if you have any suggestions for knife brand spotlight, let us know. I don't want to do anything. I didn't show you guys this droid. Druid. Sorry. Druid, isn't it? That's a 283. I like this one. Look how different they are. It's still a druid, but... I mean, look at, uh, yeah. look at this. They can't call this a druid and this a druid. No, they don't have the same blade shape or anything. No, so. they got the same steel, though. The you can call it whatever you want. The 9CR18MOV, so I guess... 
So, don't forget to like, share, share subscribe, and comment. That way you're never too far from your favorite knife and outdoor gear source. Me? No. Atlantic Knife. Oh, Atlantic. Oh, I got sign. Oh, great. Damn, great. it is. We're going to give you some specs on the newest Cold Steel Wheel. Uh, Cold Steel. Why do I keep steel saying it? Steel Wheel. I How do, do I too. do this? Steel Wheel Knife. Steel Wheel, guys. Steel Wheel. Uh, the Screamer or C will start in on his mother-in-law. Mm. If that happens, we'll be here like all week. Yeah, there's no all need day. to comment below that it's not cold steel, it's steel wheel. We, we know. I know. Yes. Just all right. tired, long day. Okay. We'll go over specs on this one. So this liner lock has a 3.2 inch D2 blade with a black stone wash and a 4.87 inch G10 handle. Uh, the blade is 0 0.14 inches thick, weighs 4.5 ounces. Of course, the pocket clip matches the wash on the blade. Uh, it's got a flipper stud and a thumb hole for opening, so if you want to use one instead. I, I like the flipper stud better on this one, but who knows what you guys will like. Um, it's also got jimping, so I like that too. Can't beat jimping. It also has a high grind for a perfect cut, and the front part of the flipper could be used as a choil if yeah. it's needed to handle the knife closer to the blade for more precision definitely. cutting. Definitely, see that definitely. Yeah. Well, you know, the blade shape Screamers. and size are a little different for steel wheel. Yeah. For a folding knife of theirs, I mean. It is a little larger. Than actually, kind of has a Kaiser look to it. It does a little. I'm liking this knife, actually. I think I think it's one of their better ones. I mean, if I had to, if I had to choose one off the table, it would either be the Modus or this one, because I'm not a big fan of fixed blades. If you have to go fixed blade, it would probably go this one. But I like the little one, too. I do. It's cute. Look at it. I like that one too. I'll I stick with my cold steel from last week. <laughs> I like the, I like this one. I like them, but you know, it is what it is. All it, right. It, again, because it's bigger, it handles you know more difficult tasks. So. Yeah. Well, I really see steel wheel as making dependable, inexpensive EDCs. Mm -hmm. uh, they've got a few tactical knives and fixed plates. I agree. I mean, they're a lesser known company, but they got the goods. I mean, they got good knives for a decent price. So. That's pretty Can't much all that. there is on Steel Wheel. I mean, they're not very old company, 2008. No, so. I mean, they, may have, they have a decent amount of models. I mean, it's probably 50. Uh, I printed 13 or 14 pages the other day to go through and see, make sure we, had, we through, had everything that they sold. I went through sold. their extensive website, but it was kind of like the these models, just different colors, different... Uh, they probably don't put everything steals. on their website. Well, I, I looked know. at their catalog for 2019, too. Did you really? Yeah, it wasn't very long. I think it was three or four pages. It had like the Play Doctor on it in different styles. Yeah, I don't think they do, but maybe... Uh, well, they did the... They did more last year than normal. They did the Tessa. Yeah. Then they did the Tenet. Doctor, Tenet. I think Tenet had already been around. Maybe it had, no, maybe not. They did about seven last year. The maybe. Tasso. That's what you're thinking, not the Tasso. Tasso. Tasso, Tasso yeah. Yeah, because right. that was their uh, one of their tactical knives. Yeah. Well, you know, pretty good. So. Yeah, so pretty good for this. Table. With that, I'm C, and this is Jewel. Just Jewel. And we are uh, Medford signing off. Way better with this. Jack knife. knife. I'm sorry. <laughs>